Hi, good evening, everyone. In this lecture, we are going to look at the first question of our 100 days, 100 COET question series. Again, beta Artha Point is the first one to go ahead and start the series. And um, this is our second season of this series. The first one was done in 2022. And now we are doing it again in 2023. Have a look at the question. Here, uh, a figure is given to you. And it says, which would cause demand curve to shift to D2, D1? So, which means that we can assume that my initial demand curve is D1, D1. And we know that our new demand curve is going to be D2, D1. So, it is asking what is going to cause this shift? What, what happens? Why the demand curve goes to D2, D1? And then four options are given to us. Cost of running. The car rises. Individual is banned from driving. Price of public transport rises. Quality of public transport declines. Let us go ahead and let us first try to analyze this diagram a bit. A bit up. What do you think from this diagram? Does this diagram represent a decrease in the demand? Does it represent a decrease in the demand of the good? Kya ye represent kar hai ki demand gir rahi hai? Let's have a look. Let's try to think about it. Till now, we have always seen that this is the demand curve. And the decrease in the demand curve. Demand curve reduce hoti hai beta. The decrease in demand curve is shown by the backward shift of the demand curve. Jab aisa hota hai, then it represents a decrease in the demand curve. That's the case. But that is not happening here. Wo yahan pe nahi ho raha hai. So then how will I interpret this diagram? Is diagram ko hum kaise interpret kar sakte hai? So now try to go ahead and try to see. In order to interpret this diagram, beta, I can take a particular price level. So jaise maine yahan pe kya kar diya na? I am taking this as D1, D1. And uske baad yahan pe mere ko ek D2, D1 diya hua hai. So I will take this as D2, D1. And what I will do is, I know that this is the price. I know that this is the quantity. But what I am doing is, I am taking a particular price. Just like I took price le liya P1. Earlier, on this price, the quantity was this, Q1. Pehle is price, the quantity Q1 demand ki jati thi. At price P1, there is the, the quantity that is demanded was Q1. अब इसी प्राइस P1 पे बेटा कितनी क्वांटिटी डिमांड की जा रही है Q1 डैश बिकॉज़ आई हैव टू मूव अकॉर्डिंग टू द न्यू डिमांड कर्व सो अर्लियर व्हेन प्राइस वाज P1 देन क्वांटिटी यूज्ड टू बी Q1 नाउ व्हेन प्राइस इज P1 क्वांटिटी हैज रिड्यूस्ड टू Q1 डैश क्वांटिटी कम हो गई है क्वांटिटी हैज रिड्यूस्ड टू Q1 डैश so you are going from point A to point B. Pehle aap point A pe the aur ab aap point B par ho. So don't you think that quantity is reducing? So actually this shift, it actually represents a decrease in demand of commodity. Ek baat to ye samaj mein aagai. That this curve is representing decrease in the demand of the commodity. Ye baat humme first thing clear ho gai beta. Now look at the second aspect. Suppose beta, I draw the same diagram. Isi diagram ko hum dobara draw kar rahe hai. And I am going ahead and I am taking quantity here and I am taking the price here. Ah. And now again beta, I have this D1, D1. I hope this light in my background is not interrupting. Sometimes it interrupts my eyes. This is D1, D1 beta. And this is D2, D1. Huh. So now think about it in another way. Suppose I tell you that I am talking about the first unit of public transport. How much were people willing to pay for that first unit? They were willing to pay this much for this first unit. P1 dash. अब वो कितना पे करना चाहते हैं इसी फर्स्ट यूनिट के लिए? They are willing to pay P1 double dash. So for the same quantity, their willingness 
to pay has fallen. वो उस गुड के लिए कम पे करना चाहते हैं दे आर विलिंग टू पे लेस फॉर दैट गुड ठीक है जी तो ये इसकी दूसरी इंटरप्रिटेशन हो गई दैट पीपल आर विलिंग टू पे लेस फॉर दिस गुड आप बेटा नेक्स्ट गुड होता है एग्जाम्पल्स कॉस्ट ऑफ रनिंग इंडिविजुअल कार प्राइजेस देखो ये तो डिमांड पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट की है सो द डिमांड ऑफ पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट हैज डिक्रीज ना यही तो हमने बोला दैट देर इज डिक्रीज इन डिमांड ऑफ द कमोडिटी बट कार जो होती है कार इज अ सब्सटीट्यूट सो आई कैन से दैट कार इज सब्सटीट्यूट ऑफ पब्लिक गुड so if i am decreasing the demand of public good and i am switching to car agar main car ki taraf ja rahi hu matlab car to less costly honi chahiye thi tabhi to main car ki taraf ja rahi hu the cost of car should have reduced beta but is it reducing no the cost is increasing wo ye bol raha hai ki cost is increasing agar cost increase hoti hai if, if cost of using a car increases will you use cars no you will use public transport then the demand of public transport should increase but the demand of public transport is decreasing so this is incorrect individual is banned from driving so if suppose someone comes and tells me you cannot drive what will i do i will use public transport so the demand of public transport should increase if i am banned from driving the car i will have to use transport but demand is decreasing na so this is incorrect ha beta is this clear theek hai beta look at the third one price of public transport rises beta tell me something if i was to show relationship between price and quantity demanded then it is always movement along the curve that price is increasing and quantity demanded is reducing jab bhi the reason is price whenever it is due to price it always is a movement along the curve so <clears throat> price of public transport increases demand nahi decrease hoti hai rather what decreases is quantity demanded decreases right beta quantity demanded reduces so this cannot be correct there will be no shift of the curve quality of public transport declines ah this explains both the reasons that if quality becomes poor then my demand will fall and if quality becomes poor then my willingness to pay for the public transport will also fall to so, dono hi reason isse correctly explain hote hain both are well explained and both tell why the demand curve is going from d1 d1 to t2 d1 both of them are explained well so answer should be d the correct answer to this question will be d is this clear okay beta thank you